Yvonne, you have the qualities I've always prayed for and also some qualities I never knew I needed in a partner. You push me to grow, pick me up when I'm down, and you always go above and beyond for me, whether I deserve it or not. When I met you, we only lived about 10 minutes away from each other, but never would have crossed paths if God didn't plan for us to meet. Thank you for being the man of my dreams and accepting me for all that I am. Even though we're cut from different cloths, we were made for each other. Thank you for being patient with me, understanding, kind, and loving. Thank you for being an amazing father to our son and partner through this journey called parenthood. I promise to love you endlessly and forever grow together. Today is the start of the rest of our lives together. As husband and wife, I love you infinity and beyond. I will always remind you how beautiful you are inside and out. I cannot thank God enough for opening your heart to me so that we can all be here today. I love you and I always will. Love is generously understanding. It does not make unfounded judgments, but rather searches for reasons. It reaches for the feelings thoughts and desires of the other and understands their changes. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. Father, will you have this woman to be your wedded wife, to live together in the holy estate of marriage, keep you only to her, so long as you both shall live? I will. Yvonne, will you have this man to be your wedded husband, to live together in the holy estate of marriage, keep you only to him, so long as you both shall live? I will. Father and Yvonne, the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Amen. You may now kiss. The scripture says, enjoy your life. When you're still young. This is the time. And we all know the wedding time is one of our best time to enjoy. And we are happy. When you meet these challenges and you have hurdles to go through, just know that you can hang on to God. That's the only thing thing I can give you that is of value. What I'd like you to encourage you to do is take the traditions, don't throw away what you've had, but just build on that and build your own traditions. And may God bless you with grace and mercy today and always. We're so glad for you and our family.
for both of you to be successful, you must learn to know what and when to do. And your wedding will become a wonderful marriage. You are going to be blessed and we shall look at you in the eye and say, these two have succeeded. May God bless you and have a wonderful, wonderful time.